I love Valor form. Um, in a title that says I'm gonna do everything, and I will do everything, the only thing I won't do is the Zephyroth battle. I have never, ever been able to do that. Even on easy mode, I've never done it. So if you guys can do it, go ahead, do it. I'm not. I know Zephyroth's, the keyblade that he gives you, Fenrir, or Fenrir, or something like that, whatever. I know it's the one of the most powerful keyblades in this game, but I'm not gonna try. <laughs> we can eat it! I suggest not so we don't die. So you guys ready to go? Now now, just a moment. Uh. Because of your previous endeavors, the worlds have returned to their original states. But that means the pathways between them have disappeared. Do not fear. If what the king suspected proves true, the worlds have prepared new pathways along which you may travel. These pathways may be utilized by unlocking special gates. How these gates are opened, I'm afraid I do not know. However, the Keyblade will serve as your guide. When a beam of light radiates from the Keyblade, return to the gummy ship. Though the worlds may seem far apart and out of reach, they nonetheless remain connected by invisible ties, as do our hearts. Our hearts are connected. That is correct. Got it. But be warned. As you proceed, the heartless and the nobodies will be using their own paths. Corridors of darkness to travel from world to world. Yeah, yeah, they yeah. Be attempting to link these dark pathways to the gates between the worlds. This game is really fun, but it's annoying with all the cutscenes. Now then, that is all the information I can give to you. Go forth, Sora, Donald, and Goofy. Donald's so short. Okay, let's get going. But even though I've played like half of the first one, I still like this one a lot better. I mean, the first one is fun, but this one is a lot better. See, when this happened, I thought he was a nobody. When that first happened, I thought he was like a nobody or a heartless or one of them. And I was like, oh my god. But no. If you played the first one, but not this one, you thought we defeated her, right? Heck no! She still lives! I guess remembering about her brings her back. If you played to the end of the first one, you'll know she's a pain. I'm just gonna tell you right now, we don't face her in this one, so I don't know. Chippendale! My favorite chipmunk. Hey, I, I, 
I think Hollow Bastion is the last place we go to in the first one. One of the last. Maleficent. Maleficent. Maybe they really did finish her off. Ooh, this castle sure ain't what I expected. No shine, no nothing. Now what's going to happen to our plan? It's Hollow Bastion. Gore, she looks kind of different now. Dance, dance, revolution. Uh oh, looks like we're gonna have to do some fighting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uncle Scrooge. Er, who? He's Donald's uncle, a business typhoon. Before the Heartless showed up, he traveled to world. He traveled the worlds on the gun on a gummy ship with the king. He was helping to to set up a traffic system, a transit system. What's all the racket? Why, if it isn't Donald and Goofy, hello lads. <clears throat> I, you all look hale and hearty. So do you, Uncle Scrooge. Ah, if only I were. I cannot. I cannot seem to recreate my favorite old-time ice cream. I'd make millions if I just got it right. Terrible. The ice cream he's making come... You'll find out what it is later, and it ties to the story somehow. I don't know. This game is kind of random, if you t focus too much on it. Nobody fight! 